you with your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso on SABC3. And it's that time of the morning where we show you how to make a quick, simple dinner recipe in a couple of minutes. And we've got Chef Wendy joining us in studio, showing us how easy it is. What are you making for us? Hi, Liesl. Today we're going to be making a creamy sun-dried tomato, butternut and baby spinach pasta. Okay, let's get cooking. Where do we Great. start? So basically what we're going to do is we're going to fry our onions mm -hmm. until they're nice and tender and a little bit golden. I see you've chopped them really, really fine. Yes, you don't really want to be crunching on the onions mm -hmm. while you eat. And then we're going to add our garlic, just a little bit of finely chopped garlic. That's nice because both the onions and the garlic rich in antioxidants. This is a really, really healthy, quick and simple dinner recipe. Okay, once that's nicely fried up, We'll add our sun-dried tomatoes, one of my favorite ingredients. Absolutely love adding these to dishes. It just brings out such a gorgeous flavor in yes. any dish. There we go. Have I turned fantastic. your stove on here? There we go. Okay, so we'll just fry that up mm -hmm. really nicely. There we go. So we've added our onions, we've added our garlic, we've added our uh, sun-dried tomato. We're also gonna add some fresh butter mushrooms, which I've seen you've yeah. just sliced. Really nice and thin. Those will fry up in a couple of minutes until they're Perfect. nice and tender. I'll give you a hand there. Thank you. Okay, what's our next step? Great. Next, we're going to add our tomato puree. Mm -hmm. And Let's a put this nice on a bit higher. squeeze of tomato paste. Now, if you're adding the puree and the paste, what does the paste do? Um, it basically just gives it a nice thick consistency, a mm -hmm. little bit of sweetness as well. There we go and good colour And to your dish. lots of nice colour. The nice thing about that, also rich in vitamin C from the tomato. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. So Next while we're up. waiting for this, let me give you the key word. If you'd like to get the ingredients list for this, send to your mobile phone, K-N-O-R-R, KNOR is our keyword. 33728 is the SMS number. And remember, our ingredients and the recipe is all available on our website, expressoshow.com. What is that you're adding? This is the vegetable stock pot, Liesl. Mm -hmm. These are absolutely fantastic. They're available in chicken, beef, and vegetable flavor. And basically, you just add it in, gives a really nice savory mm. um, depth of flavor to your dish. The nice thing about the Knorr stock pot is you now don't have to sit there and wait for hours Absolutely. making your own stock, which normally takes about 12 hours. Exactly. You've just added this into the dish. Yes, we're going to let that sort of melt into the dish. Do I need to do anything else, add water to it, or do I just no, let it melt away? just let it melt away. All the flavors from in there will infuse nicely into the dish. There we go. This looks really, really gorgeous. And you know what's also great? It's the perfect way to let the kids eat their vegetables without knowing what exactly. they're eating. I'm not a fan of veggies myself. <laughs> I've never heard a chef <laughs> admitting on Expresso that they're not. you're not a fan of a veggie. No. So basically this is a recipe that I developed to try and um, to hide the veggies. Mm. <laughs> and for yourself? Absolutely. <laughs> Did you not even like it growing up? No, not never at have. All. Never been a fan. But that's a nice thing. That's why a chef can disguise the veggies. You're still going to get the nutrients, you're still going to get the flavour, but you're going to get it hidden in a gorgeous mixture that we're going to be doing right now for our penne pasta. So basically what I've done there is I've added some steamed butternut. Mm -hmm. You can steam that in a microwave, in the oven if you have an, an oven that has a steam function. And then I'm just going to add some cream. There we go. And then I'm going to do a little pinch of sugar just to balance out the acidity from your tomato puree mm -hmm. and your tomato paste. When do you add the sugar? Because often when I'm cooking with my tomatoes, I add the sugar when I do the tomatoes. Yes. Does that make a difference if you add it then or later? I would say rather add it at the end. Okay. That way you can judge um, as the tomatoes have cooked out, you can see if it needs to be sweeter or if it's a little bit too acidic. There we go. Okay. Now, because it's national TV, you know how quick we cook on Expresso. We're trying to show everyone at home that we can make a meal in four minutes. Yes. What's our next step? Right, so what we're going to do over here, we've got our prepared um, there we go. sauce over there. Mm -hmm. We're simply I'm going to... Swap this one around for you. Give you more space to work. We're simply going to mix in our cooked penne pasta. Mm -hmm. I like to use penne purely because um, the sauce will cling quite nicely to the penne. Mm -hmm. Give that a nice And the mix. nice thing is the sauce goes in the penne, so it adds the flavour. Exactly. When you're taking a bite of the penne, you're getting that rich tomato uh, and butternut flavour. And the butternut is an incredible veggie. It's rich in magnesium, it's rich in calcium, it's uh, rich in uh, um, vitamin C, so it's really, really a healthy vegetable that you're adding there. 
Okay, now I'm going to add in some baby spinach. I quite like baby spinach because it doesn't really require much cooking mm -hmm. and it's simply just going to wilt in the heat of the sauce and that'll cook it nicely. And as Popeye said, it makes you nice <laughs> and strong. Full of iron as well. Give that a nice stir mm -hmm. and there we go, it's ready. Perfect, so how would you serve that? I'm just going to put it into a nice bowl. See, a quick, a simple, it will take normally at home. How long will it take you to make this? 20 minutes? Absolutely, maybe even 15. 15 if minutes. Well prepared. 25 minutes if it's my household. <laughs> and then five minutes to wash the dishes because you've hardly dirtied any plates. The keyword today, K N O R R to 33728. Quick, simple, easy. And remember, get to your nearest pick and pay. Look at the banner that says What's for Dinner because they give you some creative, fun ideas on how to make a quick, simple dinner recipe with the ingredients. It gives you everything that you need on your shopping list. Wendy, that looks absolutely Great. amazing. I am definitely going to carbo load on that and give it a try. Thank Wonderful. you so much for cooking Thank with you. us. Thank you. It's Espresso, your feel good breakfast for show on SABC3. Knorr, what's for dinner? Available at Pick and Pay.